Hello my jewels, welcome to or back to my channel. It is your girl Sunny J here and hi. <laughs> it's been a very long time. I, I can't take my school season with these glasses. Also, I have them closed, so don't forget. But it's been a really long time since I've made a video, so yeah. Today I thought I would just come back with a little haul, a little summer clothing haul because I haven't done those in a while. By the way, let's look at the outfit. I think I'm gonna take Insta pictures today. If I do, here you go. Here's your little OOT. This dress, got it from thrift store. This bralette, also from thrift store. I think Plato's Closet. And then these earrings are from Ross, but they're Betsy Johnson. If you don't know who that is, she's a like a high-end fashion designer. So these were steel for sure. And then these glasses are from Plato's Closet also. And yeah, I'm not gonna have these on the whole time, but in case you're wondering. Okay, it's a little high, so I'm gonna bring myself just down. Ooh, see, you didn't need to see that. Currently, you're on a set of books right now, but I just want the intro to be a little bit more cleaner because that makes sense. Anyways, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that I got, this is also from the thrift store. It's this bag, it's a purse, and it's from this brand called Herod. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, this is like the logo. And it's like a big department store in, I believe, London. I was really freaking out when I got this because I was like, oh my, because I had no idea. I just thought it was cute, but it's patent leather. Yeah, it's very shiny and fun. Obviously, I don't think I would ever wear this right now because it's 100 degrees. But for the fall and winter, I think this is perfect. Most of these pieces are very summery, but some are like some fall winter pieces just because summer in my opinion is like my off season. Like I don't really wear like trend clothes. That didn't make any sense. Oh my gosh. I don't really wear like, I don't go off on summer. I go off typically in the fall and the winter. That's typically like fashion wise, like it for me. But yeah, spring and summer are definitely like my off seasons. I don't really like dressing up. I try to wear it as a least amount of clothes as possible. Yeah, if you don't know, I live in Texas, so it's always super duper hot. But yeah, I don't think this would really be smart because it's extremely black and leathery and no. This dress is from Target. It's just a little slip dress that's like floral patterned and it is so cute. It fits very well, it's not too tight, it's not too loose as most, as most silk dresses are. I would say like this dress is pretty like kind of the same fit it's a little looser but this one's like perfect like it's not too tight but yeah and definitely am going to be wearing out i'm so i love these dresses and i'm so excited to like i think they're i think this is going to be like a trend for a while so like i definitely want to just stock up on some for like the fall and winter i feel like this color right now is also really cute like next thing this is a very chaotic haul so you're gonna get it's not gonna be organized like most hauls are this one's very all over the place. This is from Burlington. I got this dress, it's just a denim dress. Now, background of why I got this dress. I have watched the movie, oh my gosh, what is that movie? It's this movie, one of my favorite rom-coms. And the opening like scenes, one of the main characters, I forget her name because I haven't seen the movie in literally a year. But she wears this denim dress and these platform like white flip flops. And I've always wanted to recreate it. So I'm halfway done. All we have to get is the white platform sandals. Might get those, but. Bluetooth connected. I'm sorry, I don't know why the speaker is on. It just started playing. Anyways. Next, I guess I'm doing dresses then. Maybe that'll be a little bit organized. Um, This dress is from the thrift store. I'm so glad the sundresses are kind of coming back in. I mean, not that they were never not a trend, but you know, like these, like the, I forget what this is called, but like this is the top and then it's like very flowy at the bottom. I found this dress at the thrift store and I don't really have a lot of green and I want a lot of green, especially like just for summer in general. So I just got this cute little dress. I realized that it goes with like this shirt and I'm not gonna lie, like I've been trying to style it with like more, just like not jeans. And I found like one piece that goes well. I have like this maxi purple skirt. I haven't seen that in a long time actually. That means one of my sisters stole it. Anyway, yeah, this halter top is so cute. And I feel like silk ones like this, this color is very hard to style in my opinion. Especially if you don't have a lot of like browns and stuff. I feel like it goes good with that. But to find like a green piece, it like, it's kind of tacky. Like look, it kind of doesn't match. But like together, it doesn't look like too bad. Like I feel like someone who's like incredibly insane probably would notice it, but I'm not, in I 
Mm. But I didn't know. Anyways. Next dress. Let's see. This cute halter dress is from Target. It was on sale during Memorial Day. And yeah. I feel like I've always wanted like a 70s like white lined dress. But this dress is just so 70s to me. Like I, mm, I'm very, not obsessed with 70s fashion. But like it's definitely a big part of my style. And I feel like halter dresses are just something that i like and i feel like it looks really good on me but to have like this casual one that looks like a tennis dress kind of from the 70s i love i have like some nike shoes that go perfect with it so i feel like that's definitely a summer dress that i'm definitely gonna be wearing out a lot i think i wore on my instagram go follow me on there <laughs> little plug next thing i have this silk dress this dress is from amazon i tried it on and kind of showed you guys the whole unboxing process on tiktok i believe go check it out on there also go follow Follow me on TikTok. It's linked down below. I feel like the specific one. I'll link the specific one. But this is just a maxi silk dress and it has lace on it. Yellow is definitely not what I was gonna go for. I was gonna go for white because I feel like you kind of just need a white silk dress, which is why I got this. <laughs> but this one actually looks really pretty on me and I still need to find like shoes for it, but I love this dress. Very beautiful. I don't know. We'll see how I style this later. Okay, and then I guess the last type of dress type thing. It's not really a dress. So I got this onesie. Um, I've been watching a lot of like 80s stuff and after watching like Stranger Things, re-watching it before like the new season like came out and then watching the new season and then watching a bunch of like other 80s shows and stuff, I've been really like trying to just, I don't know, get out of my comfort zone, I guess, in fashion. And this is like definitely something I would never wear. Like this is what it looks like. It's very tiny, but it's very stretchy but it's from i got this from a designer thrift store it's from calvin klein i've never i don't know like i just this was calling my name so i bought it and i tried it on and it's very comfy like i i hate leggings so this was definitely like something that like you would never see me wear but i'm excited to style this i feel like this is definitely something i'd see like a model off duty model off duty like type of look i guess so i'm very excited i feel like in the winter too this would be fun Anyways, I'm saying winter a lot as if it's not 103 degrees outside and it's currently summer. Anyways, I bet this haul is going to be named like just clothing haul. <clears throat> not even like fall, summer, winter, just, just clothing haul because at this point. I got this little bralette from Plato's Closet. This was very, look at this, look at the back of this. Wait, you can't even see it, but like it looks like, it looks like that. Oh wait, that, there it is. This reminds me of like Brandy Melville, like 2014, when like those, these like bras and dresses were like a thing. Dude, it fits me like really tight though, because I thought it was gonna be super loose, but it fits perfectly. And this is really cute. I've been wanting like one of these for a long time, so this is definitely gonna be in my closet. This little thingy my bobber. I've been wanting a top like this, specifically crochet top for a while. It is the most itchiest thing I've ever worn in my life. Like I forgot how crochet is but it's the most prettiest like shirt I've ever worn. I've worn this on TikTok a couple times. Oh, what was that? That was kind of scary. Did y'all hear that vibrate? Anyways, and like, just look at the detail. Like this is so pretty and I think it's from Marshalls, I believe, but yeah, this is definitely something that I would wear. Next on like tops, I got this really pretty lace cami. I thrifted it. Very beautiful, but I have no idea how to style this. Like I've only seen people wear this late. Like I feel like, Five years ago, people would have worn this and then like some high-waisted skinny jeans and then heel or sneakers. That was like the look. Or they would like, if it was a dress, then that'd be easy. But like, it's not a dress. And I don't know how to style this. Like, at first I was like, this is easy, but like, I don't want to be basic and style it with jeans. Like, I want to do more. And I just, I don't know. This cami is just kind of killing me, guys. It's just, it's very comfortable. And I feel like this is a cute little layering piece also for like fall and winter. But also my mom gave me some of her hand-me-down. In my opinion, she has like a lot of staples from like 2014 and 2013. And I'm not gonna lie, I loved fashion during that time. I feel like stripes were definitely a big thing. And this shirt, it's very oversized on me. But if I had like some like low-waisted boyfriend jeans and black Converse, this would be an outfit. This would definitely, most definitely be an outfit. But yeah, I kind of just was like, please give this to me. I need it, don't ask why. And yeah, 
so she gave it to me this strawberry oh not the back this strawberry shortcake little t-shirt it's so cute i was gonna get in like an extra large because i wanted to wear it to bed but my mom was like no so i got it in a small um it's really cute though i really like it and i'm kind of glad i bought it in a small because i can like wear it out um but yeah it's very soft i got this from ross actually so that was pretty fun i used to watch strawberry shortcake if you can't read Oh, everything in my room is just pink and green. I look like I'm her little daughter or something. I don't know. So this shirt I got from Burlington. Notice how all these stores are cheap because I'm cheap. Part of me is like, oh my god, like I want to buy Vivian Westwood. I want to buy Dior. But the other problem is I suck at just personal finance in general. But it's so 70s. It looks kind of costumey on me, but it's just this 70s little halter. You can just tie it. As you can see, I had it tied, but it fell out. But yeah, and then it just has a little plastic back. But this is the pattern. It's very groovy, very 70s. And yeah, I think it'll be a lot easier if I had my whole entire closet to style this. But since I don't, um, I wore these with like some corduroy flares that I have and some heels, which I think was cute. Yeah, I think this is very cute. Very much 70s. This reminded me, I've been, okay, let me calm down. <laughs> I always get way too excited about this shirt. I would say my favorite like fashion movie or TV show is definitely Clueless. And I feel like a lot of pieces of my wardrobe have definitely like shown that. I have way too much plaid. Plaid is like my favorite pattern, probably because of that movie, but this shirt, I've been trying to find a shirt like this, with this specific like pattern and feel for years. And now that it's like a trend, I was like, yes, let me bang. let me let me hop off. So I got this shirt from Depop and it's so perfect, fits me so well. And it's like a cardigan also, so like I can like layer it under stuff or just wear it as a top. But this top reminds me of the party scene in Clueless and I really wanted this shirt because of that scene and to have it is just great. I don't go to parties that much but I feel like in college if I ever do this is definitely gonna come in handy. Okay now we're on to pants and skirts. No I didn't get shorts because I don't like short. I don't know why. I, I just don't really prefer wearing them. Anyways, these pants are from Motel Rocks, but I got them on Depop for like, I think like $30, which was kind of insane because these pants came up for like 85 on Motel Rock. And this is what they look like. They're flared, they're red, like animal print. And I don't know, I've been wanting pants like these for so long. Not pants like these, these specific pants for like two years, I think since quarantine started. And to finally have them, it's just so satisfying because I'm gonna wear them everywhere. I can't wear them here for obvious reasons because it's, like I said before, 100 and something degrees. But I know in the future, yeah. Oh yeah, these are, y'all are gonna see these on Instagram a lot. Next thing I got is this cute little micro mini. But yeah, this is very, this skirt is just, I don't know. Like, if you know my aesthetic, if you know my style, like I just said, 70s. So I lean to more warmer colors, obviously. Like, I am just a gold girl, always. This skirt is very, like, silver. I don't, I feel like the girls won't understand that. But yeah, I thrifted this skirt and I was really scared because I was like, dang, am I really gonna wear this? I tried it on guys and it looks so good on me. And I was like, oh, wow. Like it fits me perfectly. It's like the perfect low waist micro mini. So yeah. And I'm very excited to style this. I feel like right now I could probably style it. But the problem is like, I have a lot of like black jackets, but I left them all like in my storage and my college stuff in Atlanta. So once I get that stuff, you guys are never not going to see the skirt because it's just, it's beautiful. You see how beautiful this is. This is absolutely pretty. And yeah, I wasn't expecting to find this, but yeah. Also, I don't have a lot of pink, specifically like this color pink. So I'm excited. I'm very excited to style the skirt. Next bottom. Um, yeah, so I am on fashion TikTok. Like I see it a lot. I have two TikTok accounts, one that's public, one that isn't. And on my main account, my 40 page is mostly just like comedy videos, dance videos. It's really become, it's really got messed up. I need to like re-fix it or whatever. But my other account is just mainly fashion TikToks. And the fashion girlies that I've seen, I've been wearing a lot of cargo recently. And 
you've probably seen this on my tiktok but i got this like midi skirt from the thrift store i was really excited because i've never seen a cargo like this like i've seen a lot of cargo skirts and they're super thin they look cheap but these i don't know like the quality of them it was very nice and thick and uh, not too thick but like they felt like genuine like cargo pants and i was just very excited until i put them on and they are extremely really not big on me because they fit my hips but i wanted them to fit my waist and i thought it was going to be cute like that and it did so i don't know what to do about that part of me is just like sydney you can sew just take it in but i'm like how do you take in cargo pants like i don't want to really ruin it because that's the thing about pants like you there's a whole specific way to like take them in and i don't want to get them tailored because that costs money we're not trying to do that so i might just wear them low-waisted or maybe i won't we'll never know okay almost done guys we're almost done so i don't know if you've seen glee but glee is my favorite show of all time if you ask me a question about glee i probably i can probably answer on and there was this one episode where gwyneth paltrow's and she wore this like outfit and it changed my life forever and i don't have that outfit i only had the top but i didn't have her skirt or her shoe babe look 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 at this skirt guys this skirt literally looks identical it is a little long so i'm gonna have to like hem it a, i'm gonna hem it a little but this skirt is literally perfect and then i got these really sick oh wait sorry i never said okay before we even talk about the boot that skirt is from the first thrifted it very proud of that these boots and then look at the back like they're these weird wedges and they're so cool like the wedges are just yes and they're very you might be like oh this is a little basic but they don't they don't look basic they're like the perfect fall boots these were my mom's and they're from nine west i don't know where like purchased them from because i don't think it was nine west back but these boot guy look like look wow i love nine west so much most of my shoes are from there specifically like heels and stuff and these boots i've been staring at in my mom's room for months and she gave them because she's nice and the outfits you guys will see with these boots are endless um it's gonna be my closet forever but i'm so so excited that like the boots under like long dresses are like coming in i think that's a really big trend that's about to happen so it's such a 70s trend it's such a 70s trend and i'm so excited because it's just it's very sneaky like those boots are cool i want to see the rest of them oh but you have like a dress cover oh and then like a long little jacket oh like that that's like the outfit that i want to wear so much i cannot wait to style that but anyways yeah I got these boots, beautiful. You see them. I got, you guys are not ready for these shoes. You're not. I thrifted these heels and they look expensive. I don't know what brand this is. I'm not gonna say the brand because if it's cheap, I'm gonna be really embarrassed. But I got these heels. And like, you're probably just like, oh, these are basic black. Hey, look at that. Is that not sick? This is insane. Like, it's like, it's a mirror. I can see myself in this and it's like crazy. It's very trippy. They fit me perfectly. If I could walk in them, that would be great, but I can't. I'm gonna learn to though, I'm gonna learn to though, because they're a little high. I'm definitely wearing these like now because these are the shoes I can dress up perfectly. Then lastly, I'm obsessed with blazers. Blazer is like perfect. It's like brown, oh, you can't even see that. It looks green, but it's like very brown or I don't know, but it's like brown with blue. And it just, it looks like, it's like the perfect plaid. And I feel like I'm definitely gonna wear this. And I feel like even like with this dress, like it's a perfect little like big, like a cute little layering. And and it just i don't think i would ever wear this like professionally i think i'm just because it's very oversized it's very big beautiful love it but yeah that was it for this haul um i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you guys enjoy see you guys soon